If you want to learn everything you need to know as a nurse about cerebrospinal fluid, then this is the video for you. Cerebrospinal fluid is a clear and colorless liquid found in the central nervous system. It circulates and bathes the brain and spinal cord and is similar in composition to blood plasma. Cerebrospinal fluid has four main functions. It provides buoyancy to the structures of the central nervous system. Without cerebrospinal fluid, the brain and spinal cord would crush itself under its own weight. It also cushions and protects the brain and spinal cord from injury, such as blunt force trauma. Cerebrospinal fluid is also important for circulating nutrients and chemical signals. And lastly, it is important for the removal of waste products. Cerebrospinal fluid is secreted by the choroid plexus, which can be found within the lateral, third, and fourth ventricles of the brain. The choroid plexus is also responsible for the removal of waste products to maintain homeostasis within the central nervous system. Once cerebrospinal fluid is secreted, it is in constant motion due to cilia found on the cells lining the ventricles. Cerebrospinal fluid travels from the lateral ventricles to the third ventricle, to the fourth ventricle, to the lateral and median aperture, to the subarachnoid space, and finally to the arachnoid villi. The arachnoid villi is responsible for the reabsorption of cerebral spinal fluid and returns it to the bloodstream. This wraps up the anatomy and physiology you need to know as a nurse about cerebral spinal fluid. I hope you found this video useful, and if you did, please show your support by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you never miss a video. And please leave a comment down below if you have any video requests. Thank you, and bye!